Hi, in this lecture, we'll cover how to export scenarios from our development environment and import it into our test or production environment. So for this, we'll first have to create a scenario. So let's try to create a scenario of our mapping. Right click on the mapping, generate scenario. Click OK. And you can see that a new scenario has been generated. So there are multiple ways to export the scenario. Either you can right click on the scenario and do an export. You can mention the location over here in the directory C drive test and do an OK. Do yes. It says the file already exists. Do you want to overwrite it? Because I had already exported it once earlier. So let's do a yes. And the export has finished. So we can go and check this location. And here we see that our scenario has been exported. There is one more way to export this. So you can click over here on this designer menu icon, the drop down, and do an export. So you'll get multiple options over here. For example, if you want to do a smart export or you want to export multiple objects or your repositories, the topology, logical. So there are multiple things that you can do over here. For example, if you want to export multiple objects, you can select the export multiple objects. Click OK. It will ask the location where you want to export. So mention your location over here. Now the scenarios, for example, if you want to export multiple scenarios, so you just need to drag and drop over here. So let's say ODI underscore join, I drop it over here. I uh, create another scenario. I already have ODI sort also scenario over here. So let me drag that also. So here we have, now we'll do an export. Okay, do a yes. It says to overwrite the earlier one, do an S and the export has finished. So now we can check our folder. It shows that the both the ODI join and the ODI sort scenarios have been exported. Now, if we want to import it to any of our other environments, log into your respective environment, go into the operator in the load plan and scenario, click on this drop down, import scenario. You can mention your location over here, the import directory from where you want. So you can browse it also from here. Okay. So we have selected it to an open and your scenarios will start reflecting over here. So for example, if you want to import one of your scenarios, just tick this checkbox and do an OK. Since the scenario already exists over here, it will ask you to delete or replace it. So do a yes. And you can see over here, it has been inserted in the synonym insert update mode and the import is successful. So save it. So let's try once more. So first let's try to understand what is this import type. There are four types of import over here. It is duplication, synonym insert, synonym update or synonym insert update. So basically when your uh, scenarios, you want to migrate and there are within the same repository, for example, uh, there is one repository and you want to migrate it from one environment to another, then you will use either of these, the insert update or insert update. But if you have got different repositories, then you will use duplication. Okay. And thereafter select this scenario over here, whichever you want to do and press on OK. So this is how we export and import scenarios from one environment to another. Thank you.